So today I'm working on my 07 VX110 uh, Cruiser Yamaha and uh, I'm going to be removing the air restrictor. It's called the restrictor. That's what I call it. Some people call it a flame restorator. Whatever it is, anyway, by removing it, uh, your ski's going to feel a little bit more... It's going to feel a little bit more perky. It's going to want to get up and go a little. You know, you're going to definitely feel a difference. Uh, you might feel a little bit uh, difference on top end, uh, but definitely uh, on takeoff. So... What I done here is I removed the uh, tube that goes to my air box. I loosen that up. And then there's four bolts. Two up top. Two underneath. Basically, and you're going to just remove the whole thing. And you're going to end up with that. So there it is. This cone, honeycomb looking thing right in here. That sits in the intake. That's it. And basically what I done on my other ski is I just used a flathead screwdriver and some needle nose pliers. So what you're going to want to do is just put your screwdriver in there and start prying it up from different angles. It's very hard to do it with a phone and trying to do this, but as you can see... You just want to pry up on it. Um, it moves in there. So I'm going to put the phone down for a sec and uh, I'll videotape it once I have it halfway removed. So here it is basically halfway out. So I, what I kept doing is I kept spinning it around and putting the screwdriver in there and uh, keep prying it. But be careful because you don't want to mess this lip up. It is a very thin piece of plastic right here for your uh, the intake. So when you're prying it, try not to put too much pressure. Just keep working it. It's going to pop out. And uh, just slowly keep working it. So basically there it is. And like I said, see these edges? I kind of messed mine up, but you want to be careful. Don't put too much pressure on it. So here it is, basically out. And as you can see, it's very fine. So you're definitely going to gain a few horsepower because like I said I did do this on my other skis and I definitely felt a difference on my Yamahas you just want to check in there make sure see this little make sure you have nothing in your intake make sure it's all cleaned out wipe it out and uh, uh, basically put your throttle battery back on like it came off put your full four bolts on and that's it Thanks for watching.